No. And you know what? I've learned to notice. I've learned to pay attention to those subtle signs women send. They're not going to put up a billboard that says, hey, asshole, ask for my number, <laughs> right? You're, hey, hey, dummy, I want to get naked with you. But they will send a lot of signals if we notice and pay attention. Can you, can you please elaborate on some of those signals? Please. What I've noticed is like some of the signals that I was taught was a signal. Sometimes oh, twir twirling their hair, crossing yeah. their ankles, their eyes dilating, all that stuff and, that. And you'll yeah. approach based on the signal that you get. And sometimes the signal will be very strong. And then you'll realize that she was, well, she'll claim that she's not that into you to begin with. So please elaborate on, on what some of those signals are. All right. And, and I'll say up front, you're never going to get this right. So, but, so I, I teach a skill set to at least, to at least test. Okay. Because, hey. okay. So here's the thing. Yeah, I, I get <laughs> this stuff's frustrating. I know I'm a guy. It's frustrating. So I get that, you know, like the dating gurus, all, you know, you know, the woman twirling her hair. I, I tell you what, I, I'll, I'll be in my car at a stoplight and watch the woman sitting in front of me twirling her hair. She doesn't even know I exist. There's no guy around. I, I think I'm going to make a generalization that'll probably, you know, bite me on the ass. I think in general, the stupider the woman, the more she sits and twirls her hair. You know, yeah. she's just, you know, she doesn't have much going on other than this is interesting. You know, I'm sitting here twirling my hair with my finger. <laughs> I don't think that's a, an indicator of interest. I think it's usually an indicator of, of dumbness. So I, I would say, don't listen to the dating gurus on that. one. Now, crossing their ankles. I don't know. You know, when they say, notice their eyes, the dilation of their eyes, how the fuck are you going to get close enough to see if their eyes are dilated when they look your direction? So I think most of that's just forget it. But but women will send you signals. And I, I think a smile and eye contact are probably the, the top ones. If they just look your way and if, you know, if you look and they hold an eye contact, you know, for at least a moment or so, that's that's it. That's some sort of opening. That's some sort of open door. If it say smile at you, that's some sort of open door. Now I tell guys, I'm, I don't teach pickup. I don't teach approach. I don't tell, I don't teach guys, oh, all right, here's how you go get the hottest woman in the room to give you her digits. I don't teach that. What I do teach is attraction. That if a woman sends you a signal that appears to be an interest, go talk to her. Go do what I call testing for interest. Just walk up, tell her your name. Say, you know, how's your day going so far? What you up to? You know, doesn't, doesn't have to be clever. Doesn't have to be funny. Just you know, introduce yourself. So, what's your name? Where are you from? What's your story? Just anything. And if she seems to have interest in talking to you, all right, there's some interest going on there. And then you do, and then you test at three different levels. I can, t I can talk more about that if you want. So, if a woman seems to send you an indicator of interest, go talk to her. Just tell her your. And guys, they want to say something clever, be funny. No, if she already noticed you. You don't have to go do something to, to up her interest level. She already noticed you, okay? She already opened the door for you. Okay, now the ones, like I said, eye contact, looking your way, turning your way, smiling at you, those are the most common. If she's in close proximity, kind of bumping up against you, leaning into you a little bit, what I call the breast brush. I've had to teach women this, you know, that I had to teach the next girlfriend this. You know, she was, she grew up in Alaska and she would just like grab my crotch when she, you know, wanted to, wait, 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 does, I said, you're Winston. I said, does, does that work like on Alaskan fishermen? You know, I said, <laughs> I said, you gotta be subtle. And I said, practice the breast brush if you want. And that's a metaphor. You want my attention and having, oh, was that, she's, there, there, was that her boob that just brushed against my arm? You know, that gets our attention, right? So we notice. So women will be subtle with that. So maybe if they're next to you, they lean against you, kind of touch your hand, touch your arm. And again, those aren't guarantees. Sometimes women just do that because they just like attention, right? That's all. They just like attention. Now, the ones that, that my wife tends to point out, the women down here, uh, walking in front of you like three different times. You know, oh, see, that's the third time she walked by me. Why? You know, you know, maybe you know, I'll say, well, as, as a waitress, that's her job to walk. No, 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 no. The way she walked in front of you, it's not just because she's the waitress. I go, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or the other one, this is the one that always confused me as a guy. The waitress or whoever comes and puts something on the table and leans over where you get a total cleavage shot. You guys ever gotten cleavage shots? At Hooters, yeah. Well, at Hooters, <laughs> no. I bet you've gotten more than that. And but we guys go, oh, she just didn't know her shirt kind of hung open and you could, you know, look up and see her bra or and and women tell me, yes, they know. 
Women know that their shirt hangs open and you get a you get a boob shot. They know that. It's not an accident. I used to think, oh, they just didn't realize when they lean like see. that. Yeah, they, they know it. Now, the other one that I didn't know is that jutting a hip out. So like a woman standing and kind of just juts one hip out to the side, especially when you're behind her, right? That's primate behavior. That's, that's what gorillas do to signal I, I, I'm ready, right? And so, you know, why, why do you think every woman wants to look like Kim Kardashian? Why do you think the women get butt implants? Why do you think, you know, they, they wear their Apple jeans? You know, the butt is a signal of, of you know, pay attention. Do, do they still buy Apple jeans? Uh, no. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> no. Not anymore. I'm showing my age. You know, what, are they, what are those? Yo. So the, the woman jutting a hip out. And so these are all signals. Woman laughing at your jokes. A woman making oh, a joke. funny though, you. Robert. And, and if they laugh at you, Go with it, man. Yeah, they laugh at your jokes. Go with it. And, oh. and then escalate it. And then maybe start touching their arm a little bit. Then then require something of them. Hey, come on over here. Take their hand and lead them somewhere. Say, hey, you know, take your phone out and say, listen, I, I got to bounce, but, you know, I'm going to call you later. Give me your number. And then with your phone out in front of them, say, give it, tell them, don't ask. And, and then when they give you the number and you punch it into your phone right then and hit call and call them right there in front of them. And say, hey, you know, this is Robert, this is Glassford, this is Prince. I'm standing right in front of you. And I said, I'm going to call you later this week. I'm going to send you a message. Or I'm going to hit you up. And, you know, I just wanted you to know who this was on your phone. And then hang it up and say, there, I'm calling you back. And say, got to bounce. I'm, I'm going to get back in touch with you. So it's, it's these little things that you, you test to see how high their interest is. You, I tell guys, don't guess, test. So she looked at you, she smiled, she laughed at your joke, she jutted a hip, you got a cleavage shot, she walked in front of you three times, she looked over her shoulder at you, whatever, go go take some action, some bold action, and in, interact with her in some way to find out, was that truly an invitation? If it wasn't, no harm, no foul, no big deal, but go find out, test, don't guess. Got you.